I want to ask you something about um, uh, uh, an interesting quote I saw from Charles Koch, who, of course, is the very conservative billionaire donor um, who uh, has spent hundreds of millions, if not billions of dollars, I don't know, over time, it's hard to tally up, um, on political interventions, on setting up right-wing think tanks, uh, in super PAC contributions, and trying to keep Republicans in power. Um, giving an interview, I think it maybe from a new book, where he says he regrets his partisanship, which he says badly deep in divisions, and I'm going to read this quote for you, boy, did we screw up, he writes in his new book. I I'm just curious, as a frequent critic of Mr. Koch, uh, your response to that. Look, the Koch brothers and they are hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars help create the right-wing extremism uh, that we are seeing right now. I, I'm glad that Mr. Koch recognizes the error of his ways, but he is one of the wealthiest people in this country today. And I think rather than just talking the talk, if he really wants to make a difference, he can say, well, you know what? I'm gonna start using my money, and I'm talking about a lot of money, to bring about justice in this country. I made mistakes and I apologize for that. And I'm gonna start funding groups who believe in economic justice, social justice, racial justice, environmental justice. That is an important way that he could undo the very, very serious damage that he did to this country. And I'll add something else to that. He is one of the people who took advantage of this disastrous Citizens United Supreme Court decision. It would be very, very helpful to this country if somebody like Mr. Koch came forward and said, you know what, I helped fund the effort to bring about Citizens United. That was a mistake, and I think we should rescind that decision. That would be a big help as well.